That's cool, man. It's such a coincidence we're in the same class, Lester. And I can't believe our teacher is Professor J. Archibald Prufrock. Wasn't his dissertation on the Edwardian sonnet fascinating? Oh, he's back. Now then, class, who can give me the definition of a haiku? Very well. The haiku is an unrhymed poem of three lines comprised of... 17 syllables, the first and last lines, five syllables each, and the second line, seven. For example, this perfect haiku pales beside radiance of such exquisite grace. <laughs> the assignment for next week, to produce a haiku of uncommon beauty about the common kumquat. Wait to read my haiku. I'm sure Archie will just love it. Miss Schmeling, if you please. Weekends I purchase kumquats at grocery store. Really, really ripe. Ripe indeed. But perhaps we could brush it up after class. Oh. <laughs> Your turn, Mr. Coolman. Aujourd'hui, Mr. Coolman, today. <laughs> kumquat, oh kumquat. Man, I know diddly squat about the kumquat. Now dig. I write from my ticker. I don't write what I'm told by some dried up, withered old snooty square crow. Plant my heart like an acorn. Watch it grow strong and free. Rise up. Rise up. Oh, sweet poet tree. Come quad, come quad. Diddly squat. My response in haiku. Dear Mr. Coolman, your odious ode sucks like vacuum cleaner. Dig. <laughs> Lester, wait up. I really liked your poem. Maybe it wasn't a real haiku, but it was awful original. That proof rock's just an old stick in the muck if he can't recognize a real poet. Anyway, me and the girls are going for coffee. <laughs> See you at work tomorrow. Bye! Her smile melts my heart, like warm April sun, and me, too shy to tell her. <laughs> 